building it off of a uh, more or less a square base, and I'm using a uh, a uh, resource, stainless steel. It's um, very malleable and responds beautifully to spot welding. The material is able to move easily and to uh, capture itself. I'm assembling them and inventing as we go along, trying to figure out what possibilities, you know, looking for the aesthetic moment in the, uh, in the process here and reinforcing it. And the results being a very playful, symphonic series. Working with the reaching face all the way around, a cut, a bend to give it strength, then forms into a structural element here. Again, actually years ago, when I was first making sculpture, I began making these things with uh, tin cans. I used to take uh, tin cans, probably dog food cans, if I remember right, Alpo dog food cans, and we'd cut them up with uh, a pair of shears and, and assemble them with solder. Pretty and varied and manipulatable and very much like a drawing. The spaces are stunning. Getting inside them and watching them move is just wonderful for a, a guy who thinks that's wonderful, like me.